All right, this is a train lock, a typical train lock for a children's train ride. Opens on this bottom. There's a little button. Okay. And they twist these off. They think these open it. And they will twist these off all day long if your driver doesn't see these kids. And this is the latch. And these tend to vibrate loose, so you've got to tighten these screws a lot. And um, uh, sometimes I glue them, but I don't prefer to because it ruins the paint and other things. Um, to me, I would put bolts all the way through with aircraft nuts on the back of the door. That would be my preference. Because these wear out in the wood when you constantly have to screw them in and out. But you can adjust, take this piece off with two screws and you can adjust in and out as you go. Here's another one where they remove the little doodah on it. And the springs will go bad in time because they're used really a lot. This particular one spreads apart, especially when customers get in on this car. This is a handicap car. I call it the black limo ride. Um, use this mostly for handicap children. you got to load in and out. And then uh, very overweight people. You want to try to keep most of the overweight behind the logo or spread it out evenly amongst the trains. Um, so, this lock problem, we are moving this down here where there's less space from up here. And this will vibrate open and loose, so I'm gonna add an additional one. So that's what we're doing right now. This one's set, and all we have to do is add this other piece in, and we'll move it to where we need it to be, and see how close we are. All right? So let's, we're going to get this done and we'll show you how it looks after.